Hi guys, welcome to another video. Um, today I'm going to be um, looking at both the uh, the Archie Sonic comics and the IDW Sonic comics and everything, and uh, and the and the comparison of the both of the comics and everything. Um, I've just started um, reading the uh, the Archie Sonic comics um, from the beginning and everything. Um, I never read them before and everything. Um, you know, I, I, it's something I always want to read and everything. So yeah, um, I've, I've, I've been st I've been reading the Archie Sonic comics from the beginning and everything. Um, from, you know, from issue one and everything, um, I'm up to um, issue thirty at the moment. And everything, um, I find the um, I find the Archie Sonic comics really interesting at the moment. And everything, um, from the to to the um, to the added other Sonic comics here and everything, as you can see. Uh, I just wanna uh, just wanna go through the a brief history of the uh, the IDW, I mean the Archie Sonic comics here and everything. Um, just have a, just gonna have a look at the contents wise here of the uh, of the comics and everything. So it's just so this series been run for about a total of twenty four years since ninety three to 20, 20, 2017. and they've done about they've done two hundred ninety issues um, before its cancellation. And everything um, the series um, the record for the longest uh, video games comic long you know the history you know there and it's going from there the basis from. Um, you know the series features a mixture of character setting, the storyline, um, you know from the Saturday M, the cartoon show, um, you know from the and the video game and everything. Um, so this is just the content of the. Just gotta have a quick up the uh, this this actually got Sonic comic. Uh, it's really interesting. So it's just a, it's just a, a quick overview of the um, the main focus of the comics. The uh, storyline was the title characters were famous for all that and everything. Um, you know the counterparts in the comic. Uh, it's, it has having important ties with with his family and friends and everything, as you can see here. I thought um, it says uh, Sonic uh, normally goes uh, adventure adventure by himself. You know the video games and and it just says everything about it here. Um, so they said that the basic of the original um, issues were designed to closely mirror Son you know Sonic Saturday AM, um, as well as um, the name likeness of you know the uh, Sonic allies. You know. The freedom fighters. Uh, since then, uh, the series has been great in many uh, elements from the video games. You can see here. He just tell me there like the story arcs involving Knuckles, and, you know, and others. So this the setting is it, it, you know in this it, it just said this the series kept to a single uh, comedy that you know lasted for the the first two hundred forty seven issues as well as more spin offs uh, before switching to an alter you know continue from the issue 252 onward um well the two continues are com you know completely different to each other um at their core they are still connected in terms of overall storyline with the um you know consider the reason for the switch and everything um so this is just so that's a brief overview um i just want to look at the i the comparing this you know the idea of the sonic comics here uh, so i'm going to look at this one so So yeah, you know, so this is the idea of a Sonic comic. Uh, the series is the uh, you know basis. So it's it's you know we know it's distributed by the idea of a Sonic, the uh, idw publishing, and it began on the fourth of April, twenty eighteen. Um, the comic series began with the first four issues being uh, you know released each week in April, followed by a monthly release of some, you know of issues started in May, twenty eighteen, and like the Archie series. Um, the IDW Sonic comics are also being translated uh, by Sega of Japan, the uh, Japanese audiences, uh, with a slight import uh, lag between the original and the trans translated releases. Um, so we're going to look at the. So this, so going to look at the development. It just, it just tells you about, you know, here how it all began. You know, they do. He said, uh, Sonic, you know, in July, um, you know, this way revealed this, you know, Sega and IDW publishing, um, will be cl collaborating, um, together to create a new Sonic, uh, comic, um, after the, uh, cancellation of the, um, Archie Sonic comic, um, comic, the two days period, um, the first official creative, uh, Sonic was, um, conducted on the you know, on 3rd of August 2017, as you can see here. It just tells you about the um, all that. So we've got. 
So, but I, I want to look at this setting of it um, of, of the IDW Sonic comic. Uh, the comic is set in the um, you know the video game. Continue with the visuals of the um, the comic being heavily inspired by the um, recent game. And his friends live on a planet named Earth. Him that by he said there. And you know like themselves and everything. Um, prior to the start of the comic, uh, the battle between um, Sonic and um, you know, you know, the Eggman Empire has been going on for quite some time with with the heroes um, having fought Eggman multiple times before. Um, many flashbacks to the previous Sonic uh, game events. Um, you know, he said, but when the comics still are beginning, Sonic and his friends are dealing with the um, the fallout cause of Eggman's recent conquest um, of the planet. Um, he said, um, Sonic forces and everything. He's, he's, he's just said, uh, which has been most of recent Sonic um, games at the time. So he says, um, he says a few things there about, you know, the, uh, the series, you know, and everything here. So we know the storyline to it, here, as you can see. So that's a brief, brief idea of Sonic. Um, we know the storyline and everything. Um, but I I only just got into the actual Sonic comics. Um, I know a lot. Of, I know a lot of you guys um, love the. Uh, you know, people people have different opinions of the comics of the actual Sonic comics. You know, to the IDW Sonic comics, uh, they're very both different settings and everything. Um, you know, because it's you you're gonna have, you're gonna have people not liking like some people are not gonna like actual Sonic comics. Some people are going to be a bit, you know, like, you know, the idea of Sonic comics. Because they're two different settings and everything um, and all that. Um. So this is going for the issues of for this actually Sonic comic and everything. Um, it's just, you know, the year was, you know, I'm I'm just, I'm just basically just started from, you know, I'm on, I, again, I'm just, start, I've just finished the um, issues um, 1 to 30 um, and also the uh, the mini series of Sally um um, you know, Knuckles and everything. Um, it's really interesting. Uh, the Archie Sonic comic's really interesting. I'm just getting into it. Um, you know, as much as I love uh, the idea of the Sonic comics, um, the they're both com the both good comics in their own ways and everything. Uh, they're really they're really fantastic to each each of the own ways of the comics of the Archie Sonic comics and the um, the idea of the Sonic comics. So these are going from the issues here, as you can see. And it, this is going like the backstory of it, telling you know the uh, the backstory of introduced you know famous Morbius twenty five years later and everything. Um, I'm not got that far here yet and everything. They're going up to this storyline. So this is coming. This is coming off the. Um, I think. I think it's a uh, canon going off the Sonic Forces and it carries on from there and everything of the. Uh, this storyline here saying, um, you know, doing the Empire War, um, you know, the evil Doctor went missing, however, his botany is remaining. He's just saying, going from here. It's really interesting because, I, you know, the, I find the, I find the actual Sonic comics um, really interesting now. I'm, I'm, getting, I'm coming into it and everything. Um, like you guys... Um, you know, advise me on, you know, on different, on different ways to read and everything. Um, you know, he said it's gonna be, it's gonna be up and down with the Archie Sonic comics. Um, I, you know, with Ken Penders and everything. Um, I just learned about this guy. I wanna, I wanna talk about this. Uh, just go down here. Just gonna talk about the cancellation. Uh, Yeah, I've been following the the, the cancellation of this, how it happened. Uh, the actual Sonic comic series was cancelled 2017. Um, the reason for the title's ultimate cancellation is, um, yeah, various sources, uh, however, seem to hit a um, number of mishaps, including various uh, licensing, licensing fees needs for the uh, World Unite and the, um, you know, the storyline of being barely enough to, to recoup the cost. Um, the, the, the other one is the... Um, the Riverdale Reborn Institute, um, you know, saw the main actually uh, titles council be launched, um, notably for the company bringing out 
that Kickstarter to fund the launch of the three other titles and being forced to shut it down after, you know, after much backlash. Um, the TV series, uh, Riverdale, which proved to be, you know, something... Um, and then I heard about these lawsuits, uh, a second lawsuit, this one's involved in a former artist, uh, Scott there and everything. Um, I only just know a brief, I only briefly know later about this lawsuit with uh, Ken Pen. I think he's, he's, he's called Ken Pen or something like that. Um, I don't know much of the um, the cancellation to it. I only know a bit of the the artist on it coming cancellation and everything. Um, you know, it, it, it worked. You know, it, it's, it's something like that anyway. Um, but anyway, the um, and then it came to the reboot here. Um, the, I'm glad Eve Eve Flynn stepped in here, but we'll just have a read here. The reason behind the comics reboot in uh, 2013 um, to be a uh, several behind the scenes. One of the biggest, you know, it just says. So there we go. It says here running legal battle uh, between Archie's uh, comics uh, and former Sonic writer Ken Pendens, um which he copyrighted several of the characters and content um, he brought to the series, which made up a sizable chunk of the uh, Sonic uh, comic universe. Um, this has rendered uh, said characters and content unusable in new stories, making the um, you know that the original concept important to the work since so much you know dependent on the Pendle's concept. Um, the reboot uh, came at a rather short notice for the comic. Um, Ian Flynn has gone on to the state that he had plans for the original content for issue um, as far as issue 300, um, but it got cancelled and, and anyway. And uh, as it's saying now and everything, um, I'm glad um, you know Ian Flynn uh, came into it and um, you know turned things around and everything. Um, you know, here and everything, Ian Flynn there. Uh, and then coming on to the side of the start of the, you know, starting off here with the idea of Sonic Comics, um, Ian Flynn, he, he's just actually fantastic. Um, really enjoy the ideas of Sonic Comics, um, you know, but um, they're both good in a way. The, the idea, you know, the actual Sonic Comics are really good as well. Uh, everybody's going to have different... Let's go up here. Uh, you know, everyone's going to have different opinions of of each of the comics and everything, um, you know, they're, just, they're both fantastic. Um, I'm just getting into the again with the Arch Sonic comics and everything. Uh, I'm in, I'm enjoying it so far and everything. Uh, but but here on the IDW Sonic comic side, um, I am a fan of it uh, more more than the Arch Sonic comics. But I'm not, you know, it's you know I'm enjoying them both and everything. But at the moment. Um, I'm enjoying the idea of Sonic comic just as well as the Archie Sonic comics. But I, I always just started um, reading the Archie Sonic comics and everything. Um, you know, I'm really enjoying this as well. Um, you know, you got got fantastic covers here as well. As you can see here. Yeah, there's a lot of changes of the um, of. You know, going through the Archie Sonic comic the early years, uh, you know, things have changed around uh, since, since uh, Ken Penders uh, left and everything. It's really interesting. Uh, it's it's kind of, you know, the Archie Sonic comics, um, it's, it's, I can't explain it. It's like a, a very strange setting to it. Um, you know, down the idea of Sonic comics, um, because what, you know, what everything... Uh, I knew you guys. I know. I know you. I, I know you guys told me it's good. You, you're gonna have like an up and down and everything. Um, the story goes a bit weird. Go. It goes a bit offsetting of the Archie Sonic comic term with uh, Ken Pen Ken Penders and everything when he's in it and everything. Um, when he was doing when he was um uh, taking charge of it. Um, I can understand now and everything. Now it's yeah. It's uh. Yeah, I can understand the covers and everything when things change and you know and, and very strange thing. Then it then it goes like from bad, you know. I know you guys told me about it. It goes from bad to the worse, and then it goes good again and everything. Since uh, when Ian uh, picked it up, uh, Ian Flynn and everything. Yeah, I can understand it now. Um, I can understand what you guys mean now and everything when it. When he um, when he left and everything, um, 
when a, when Eve Flynn came into it on Initiation 160 and everything, um, that's when he turned things around and everything. Um, you know, when when I, I read all the reboot ones, they're really fantastic and everything. I really enjoyed the reboot reading them, and then I'm now going back to the beginning of of the Archie Sonic comics and everything. Um, you know, they're really interesting to comparing to the IDW Sonic comics again. You know, the art is fantastic in these comics. Uh, you can see there. I I love I I love the um I love the uh, the idea of something I'm done this is just my opinion and everything. I love the IDW Sonic comics more than the the Archie Sonic comics but because I didn't know about it back at the time when I was younger and everything, um it would have been different if I read you know, you know, it would have been different if I read the Archie Sonic comics from there. Um if I if I if I you know, I didn't, I didn't know about, you know, Sonic comics back in them days. Um, I've always just began to get into the Sonic wise, uh, you know, back in the early nineties. Um, you know, you had, you had the other Sonic comics as well, but I, I, I didn't know much about the, the comic wise back in the nineties and everything. Um, but I'm, I'm glad I did now uh, that you guys told me and everything. Um, but I, you know, I, the actual Sonic comics is good as well. Um. Yeah, it's really interesting the Archie Sonic comics as well, um, but, but I, c I can see why now and everything. I love, I, lo I just love the. Uh, this is a. So yeah, I'm, I'm reading the early, the early days of the Archie Sonic comics and everything at the moment. Um, I read this issue. I've read it. I really enjoyed this one. Um, I'm not. I've just, I just finished reading issue thirty of the Archie Sonic comics. It's actually fantastic now. Um. But they're both really interesting and everything at the um of the actual Sonic comics here. Uh, sorry, the IG Double Sonic comics here and the artwork's actually fantastic. Um I think on the um I think on the artist side I I love I love the um the IG Double Sonic uh comic panels and everything. Um I, you know, I like them. I like the artist style. Of, you know what they've been doing, everything. Um, the idea of a sonic artist and everything, what they do. Yeah, the but, you know what, the the both um, the both really interesting comics again. Um, the artist sonic comic here. Yeah, you know, and the IDW Sonic as well, um, but I'm I'm more interested. I'm more in, I'm more interested in the uh, I'm I'm more into the uh, IDW Sonic comics uh, at the moment because I find them really interesting and everything. Um, some people are really different to it. Uh, some I, I can understand some people like um, some. A lot of people like the uh, the Archie Sonic comics and everything. I can understand that, and every everyone's different and everything. Um, you know, some people like you know some people can like love the both the uh, the comics and everything. Um, I'm 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 just gone into again into the Archie Sonic comics, but I find it really interesting and everything. Um, you know, the Archie Sonic comics just as well as the uh, the I did the I did double Sonic comic series, but hey, this is just my opinion and everything. Um, I I like the. Um, I love the idea of Sonic comics more than the uh, the actual Sonic comics, but again, I'm only just getting into the actual Sonic comic wise and everything. Uh, but that might change again and everything when I get a, get into a few more issues and everything. Um, but they are the both the both have the you know they both have the downsides to each of the comics and everything. But they're both in the way they're both fantastic and everything. You know, it's it, it's one of them things and everything. Um, you're gonna have, you're gonna have, you know they're both. You know, they're both the book of comics and everything and you can't you can't really fault and people have people got have different opinions on it. Um 
you know, from the uh, Arch Tonic Comics and the um, the IDW Tonic Comics. So yeah, um, so yeah, I'm just gonna so so I'm just gonna give me my final conclusion now and everything uh, and my final thoughts. Um, to be honest, my favorite um, my favorite comic series at the moment is the IDW uh, the IDW Tonic Comics because I, I started that that's 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 my very first um, the very first issue I read of the uh, you know I just got into the um, the first uh, Sonic comic book for me and everything, um, because I never had the chance to um, read the old um, the Archie Sonic comics because I didn't know about it at the time and everything, um, you know, and the comics of it and everything. Um, if somebody told me, um, you know, at the time and everything, um, if somebody told me way back in the night and they told me about the the you know the Sonic comics of the Archie Sonic comics, I would I would definitely get it and everything. Um, but that would that would have been different, but. But I, I, in back twenty eighteen, I, I, my first issue was the uh, my very first Sonic comic issue was the Archie Sonic comics and everything, um, and that's how I got into the 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 IDW Sonic comics and everything because I love I love the series and everything, um, you know the spin off the mini series, the anniversary, the annuals and everything, um, you know just as well as you know I you know I don't know I don't know much about the Archie Sonic comic. I'm only just started to get. To know the Archie Sonic comics and everything, but my preferred um, comics, you know, is the IDW Sonic comics. Um, I'm a big fan of it and everything. The IDW Sonic comics, that's for me and everything. Um, but when I, when you know, when I start to read more of the Archie Sonic comics, um, I'll, I'll see then, you know, what I what I think of it then and everything. But at the moment, um, I'm I'm just I'm I'm towards the IDW Sonic comics because I love the series and everything. So yeah. Um, yeah, I love the I love the idea of Sonic comics and everything. Uh, just you know, just as well this one. Um, but again, I've just started um, getting to. I've only just started getting to the actual Sonic comics, and this is my chance now and everything. Um, but I might, you know, when I get a few down the issues down the line and everything, um, and I'll see how I feel when it when I get to the issues. I know you guys told me saying um, it's going to be up and down. Um, you know, you know, you. you you're gonna get some story. You're gonna get good stories in the Archie Sonic comics, and then it goes like up, then it goes down. Um, it's so much similar to like this one, the IDW Sonic comics, because um, at the moment um, they're, they're on the hit hideous, um The IDW Sonic comics for issue sixty nine because they're focusing on the um, Fang the mini series and everything. Uh, I know I know a lot of people don't like that and everything. They just they want the next issue of the um, you know keep it going, but. Unfortunately, that's how that's that's how the double tonic for you. I mean, it's 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 different. It's different to both of the um, the actual sonic comics and the IDW double sonic comics. So yeah, um, so I just run it down. Um, so my favorite. So I'm just. So my final conclusion is, you know, comparing to these comics and everything. Um, I love the IDW double sonic comics more than the actual sonic comics because I always just, you know, I always, you know, could have been with the IDW double sonic comics for a long time now. Um. 2018 and everything um, compared to the actual Sonic comics, but but they really both go Sonic uh, comics and everything. And you know, to be honest, I, I enjoy both reading on them. You know, it's the the good the good the good to the run and everything. Each of the run of the uh, the actual Sonic comics and the IDW Sonic comics as well. So yeah, um, so my, my final uh, so my favorite so the final conclusion to this uh, at the moment for me is the. Um, you know the 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 comparison. Um, I I like the um, the IDW Sonic comics more um, than the actual Sonic comics, but you know everyone's different. And everything at the end of the day, uh, it's just it's just matter of everybody's opinion really. Uh, what you like and everything. Um, you know it, that's 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 for, that's for everybody and everything. So yeah. Um, so yeah. So so that's my final thoughts of the um, of the of the comparison of the uh, the comics and everything. Um, and everything. Uh, I like the IDW Double Sonic comics and everything. Um, so yeah, so so that's my final thoughts of those two and everything. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, me going through both of these comics together and everything. Um, if if you have a favorite of the, um, you know, if you have a favorite of you know which comics you love and everything. Uh, if you like the Archie Sonic comic or the IDW Double Sonic comics, uh, feel free to comment down below and everything. Um, love to hear your thoughts and everything. Um, which comics you like? Which comics you like? Uh, like the Archie Sonic comic, or you love the IDW Sonic comics, like how much did I do and everything? So yes, yeah, so that, 
so that's it and everything uh, really t um just like to say just like to say thank you very much for watching you the subscribers you the viewers um, you are fantastic and everything um check out my other videos for your house content on, on the uh, channel and everything like the idw sonic comics um the actual sonic comics now and everything which is on there for um, to give people a chance to read and everything um i just i just like to say thank you very much for watching and thank you